Well guys, this is me. Been out for a bit of a hike in the woods today. Sorry, I've got a mouth full of smoke then. Um, as you can see, there is a trail there. Goes up through there. Eventually leads into a golf course further up. I'm just um, warming up some water for a cup of soup. And uh, yeah, a little flask there with some milk in it for tea. And today, yeah, again, I have my Pathfinder cup. I absolutely love this cup. Awesome cup, as you can see. A little bit of that. And as you can see, yes, I did use a lighter today. Um, what else have we got? We've got a little Rocky, some coffee sachets, got some tea bags, my water and just a little day pack, cheap one, and I'm just using my rubberized poncho for uh, a mat to sit on. Obviously I've made myself a little tripod. Um, as you can see, it just goes out, sprays out so I can raise it, lower it, whatever. Um, just to get it to where I want it. Just literally just here to boil some water today. As you can see, it's literally that is just a bit bigger than my fist roll as a ball. So, I'm um, just going to eat my apple while that's boiling. Right, well, I've just put um, the lid on my uh, Zebra Billy can just to um, bring it up to its final bit of boil. It's already started getting hot. I've had a few more little bits of wood, etc. Um, just give it a little bit of a stoke here and there. But yeah, we're getting there. Finish me apple now. I'm gonna uh, save me Rocky for uh, once my tea's done, I think. And have that with my cup of tea. Because I am gonna have tea even though I've got a bunch of coffees. So yeah. Well, I changed my mind. Decided to go for a, a Maxwell House coffee. Um, I've left some water in the pot, dropped it right down on top of the coals. The coals, as the fire's gone out now, it's just coals. Um, they're pretty much going out quite fast anyway, but by the time I've finished that, I can give it a quick rinse out and I can have my um, asparagus cup of soup. So, yeah. Well, guys, there you can see, still got me uh, drinking my cup there. Little tripod with me walking sticks on, and that this is where I obviously the area I was sitting. And as you can see, just covered over the wet ground that's left. But I poured the uh, fire out, spread the ashes, and that after they were soaked and out. But yeah, as you can see, leave no trace. So, guys, just on my walk back from camp. Um, Day's hike really, um, but uh, I've come up this path here. Just as I come past this big tree, I thought there was a horse or something looking at me. Actually, a tree stump that's been sort of uh, modified in a way. <laughs> Laughing out there. This is actually this whole area where I am now is actually part of a reserve. Um, so yeah, it's. Uh, quite a lot of people and uh, it can be quite busy as well well guys back here at civilization as you can see car park is just there and obviously I have just come from up there so uh, yeah hope you enjoyed the vid um, I'll be putting that up shortly uh, yeah, didn't realise how brilliant these walking sticks are for walking. Um, these are only a five pound, six pound set from eBay. Um, but uh, absolutely brilliant for walking. Um, especially when going up hills or um, when you're going into a dip and back out the other side. Um, the stability that they give you when hiking as well at speed, unbelievable. 
Um, so these are brilliant. I'm going to keep hold of these ones. Um, they are a little bit short for me, I think, because I'm quite tall and over six foot. Um, but I think what I'm going to do is buy a more expensive set and keep this set as a spare set. Um, or even just keep this set for small day hikes like today. Um, because obviously I can also turn them upside down use them for my basher or for my poncho. Um, so yeah, they're perfect. But love them. Brilliant. Anyway guys, good day to you. Hope you have a lovely weekend.